Okay, so I'm listening to uh, watching a video right now talking about why the Gumpla put the kids up. I'm not, not gonna mention the channel, but <clears throat> you know, um, for the price, you know, you get what you pay for, and sometimes you get more than what you pay for for the price of a bootleg Gunpla or Gundam or whatever. <clears throat> uh, you know, just check the reviews for me. As long as the kit looks okay, I don't care how it's built, as long as it looks okay for the display. Why? Because you're just going to display it. <clears throat> I have uh, a lot of Bandai kits, so as well as a lot of bootleg kits, third party kits. Uh, uh, over a decade, they're just there collecting dust. Well, as, as soon as uh, we'll buy a new house and build a shrine, proper shrine, uh, with glass uh, cabinets, you know, so it won't, won't collect dust. Uh, but that's not a priority right now, so... <clears throat> you know, who cares about, you know, the build quality, you know? Uh, you, uh, I think, uh, we just have to be practical. Especially uh, right now, you know, uh, prices are increasing. Uh, inflation. I think the prices for model kits, I think, have doubled. I think for the past, after the pandemic, I think, you know, I don't know. Is it just me or <clears throat> the model kit prices have doubled? So I think it's just best to buy like <clears throat> uh, bootlegs. So and, and then uh, for me, I'm converting to <coughs> I'm almost a hundred master grades. So I'll stop collecting. Uh, there will be no space soon. Uh, there's a lot of space here, but I, but I want my house, two floor house, to be spacious. So I don't want too much master grades. But <coughs> uh, I want to keep on doing gunpla. And uh, my idea is I'm going back to, to gunpla, but to HD4. Anyway, uh, AMGs are overrated. Uh, there's not much build divers, uh, build fighters, uh, I think, uh, and build divers as well with, with MG. So there's a. Oh, what happened? Oh, I shouldn't be spotted. Um, <coughs> they didn't read the instructions. Uh, <coughs> with HG, also, there's a. A lot of HG bootleg kids right now, like Huyan and Modong in there, so uh, they're cheap, you know? So, and if it's uh, second hand, or even if it's still unbuilt, brand new, and uh, someone bought it, you can save a lot of money as well. So I think I'm gonna buy uh, a bootleg HG uh, Reborns and uh, load the Astray. I'm not sure if there's a Bandai load the Astray already, but it's a lot of savings, you know. Just for let's say 10 bucks, maybe 11 bucks. That's already two high grade kits that are unbuilt. That's a pretty good deal. So uh, aside from that, most importantly. There's no, not much build divers, uh, build fighters with master grades. So I can't wait for 10 years just to, uh, for a transient Gundam to release. Is there already a transient or a denial Gundam? So I regret selling my denial Gundam in my uh, build burning back then. Because I had this stupid idea, what if I made a custom MGBF, but I did make some custom MGB, MGBF, but you know, uh, just cost so much. It, it cost almost like a <coughs> P Bandai if you want more than a P Bandai anyway, like two or three P, -ba P Bandais if you want to be uh, <laughs> uh, more accurate. Maybe five P Bandais if you want to be more accurate uh, with your custom uh, version of your favorite uh, Build Fighters kit. So. Which is a lot more selections in uh, HG, so build fighters, build divers, so uh, what else? Uh, it's also so cheap, Moon Gundam, I'm getting a Moon Gundam, I have one reserve, uh, I have like uh, maybe 20, more than 20 kits already on my list that are bootleg, so 
with with a with a price of just a couple of mgs you know it's like already like how many uh, bootlegs maybe more than 20 uh, not sure but yeah so it, it, let's say uh, one mg is like uh, based on the old price It's like six bootleg brand new. But uh, but today's price one MG is if you buy a Toy Kingdom Bandai is like twelve bootlegs already. Oh uh, yeah, I think I spent like how much sixty dollars including shipping and it got me like nine bootlegs. How about that? Including shipping. But that's for our store, so I, I, want, I want my personal collection. So yeah, I think it's also much cheaper to custom uh, kit bash. But uh, I, I think I'm gonna stop doing that. I think it's, it's, it's cost a lot of money. You know, I like kit bash a Bandai. Uh, I kit bash a Bandai. P Bandai Netaku and uh, Bandai HG1100 Netaku with like the Octopus Shin Netaku, Dr. Octopus Gundam. So, yeah, uh, for the money, uh, bootlegs are just better, you know. Uh, who cares, you know, what people say? And, you know, uh, uh, Bandai still has issues, you know, weight issues, whatever, holding the weapon issues, whatever, hand grenade issues. So, they're still the same, you know. Uh, yeah, Bandai plastic is softer, you know, but problem with Bandai. Uh, plastic, you know, I have some Bandai kits, you know, now they're, they're yellowish. So, yeah, you, you can clean them. So, what about the stickers and your, your panel lines and your paint? What about your decals? So, you're just going to clean your, uh, you should do those yellowish parts with whatever uh, solution, uh, liquid solution. So, what happens with the, to the stickers? So, maybe just not do for her uh, decals. Or dry transfers, maybe just no, don't apply any of those. So, but you know, <laughs> gonna get boring. No, if not, uh, Bandai plastic also gets brittle. So, uh, what's what's new? So, better, uh, you know, better just save money, you know. Anyway, all even Bandai, uh, all kinds of brands, even Bandai has issues. So, even uh, about like long time ago, like action figure uh, Gundams, uh, wing <coughs> a set. Sets, uh, set, wing set of action figure Gundams, I uh, forget what it's called, it's made of, I think, mostly rubber, or if not, uh, early rubber, I'm not sure, no, uh, a friend just came up, came by and played with it a little bit, and boom, loose joints, loose polycaps, loose uh, legs, so, what's, what's the point, so, I'm mostly gonna buy, uh, bootlegs now unless I can find a good deal for Bandai kits or or unless there's really like really no option uh, to get a good option this example for like H for 114 114 for uh, one one no grade one one for four uh, Mercurius in bed so I know they're not HGs, you know, but the HGs pre Bandai, P Bandai, what the crap? Uh, they're, it's, they're not HG, but they're on the same scale, you know. Uh, there's also a lot of selection in, in, in uh, what, HG 144 or 144, whatever. A 1144 one, one, scale, uh, like the. <coughs> like the Buster variant. Um, yeah, it's less detailed, you know, but it's less the price, so less space, but I just less, less space, less price. If, if it's built or semi-built or has a little bit of issues, even lesser price. So, and also uh, a lot of people just give away high grades. So I was given like two master grades last month by my client, but I have a lot more friends that give away. High grade, so you know, uh, don't underestimate high grade. So I think, uh, yeah, uh, I regret, you know, uh, not.
pursuing high grades because uh, uh, I'm like a curious and a, sometimes I'm stupid perfectionist. So, you know, perfectionist will be my downfall. So I don't want to be perfect anymore. I don't want to have the perfect feedback, the perfect uh, scale collection anymore, you know, the perfect style or whatever, paint design. So, you know, uh, I just want to have more gunpla, you know. <clears throat> uh, it's, it's a short life, you know, worrying about uh, those... Oh, I think the Frost Brothers. So, Frost Brothers. I'm gonna max. They remind me of the Frost Brothers. So, uh, yeah, worrying about bootleg in the... You know, worrying about what people say, you know, life is short. You know, people say, oh, you're chasing enemies. Uh, I don't want to waste my time, you know. I'm too busy. I'm too, too busy doing karate, doing business, uh, doing work, chores, obligations, whatever. I'm too busy resting. So, uh, I want more time to enjoy my life, you know. And, uh, yeah. So, uh, forget about what people say, you know, just... Uh, Life is short, you know, buy all the gunpla that you want as long as you have space to play, space to uh, uh, <coughs> place them. Or maybe not, as long as you have place to store them, who knows, you might get uh, your own place in the future. And it's going to be hard to get the gunpla that you like in the future. Or in the future, <laughs> it could be twice the cost. So that's it. Thank you so much for watching. Like, share, subscribe.